Day 15, Prince of Peace. Do you sometimes just long for peace? As the old man Abraham looked to the stars, God made a promise. He announced that through insignificant Abraham, he would pour out great blessing, not just to God's people, but to all nations on earth. Through the prophet Isaiah, God declared that this incredible blessing was to come through one man yet to be born. In Isaiah 9, 6 and 7, he promised, For a child is born to us, a son is given to us, the government will rest on his shoulders, and he will be called Wonderful Counselor, Mighty God, Everlasting Father, Prince of Peace. His government and peace will never end. Our families, our country, and our world struggle to find peace. But it is only through God's promised one that this is truly possible. Ooh. Through his birth, life, death, and resurrection, Jesus has brought peace for those who trust in him. True peace between us and God. And although we can taste the goodness of this peace now, we long for heaven where with Jesus, true peace will never end. Let's pray. Lord, as we journey through this Christmas season in a time with so much uncertainty, we thank you for your true and perfect peace. Help us to remember we have access to this peace both now and in eternity. In Jesus' name, amen. Merry Christmas from the Lubers family. Matt. Kelly. Morning. Elizabeth. And Emily. Merry, Merry Christmas. Christmas.